morning guys so we are here at the lakeland antique mall in florida and i have a ton of disney stuff that i wanted to show you all with some antique items and they also sell disney props i have so many things it's insane a lot of seven doors and mickey mouse and minnie mouse also they do require masks so that is why my voice is a little muffled they have a ton of Disney pins. These are three and four dollars, and then you have five and six. Some of them are on the tag, and some of them are not. We have another one here. Wow, all the way from 2003, guys. How crazy is that? This is great for gifts and people who like antique things, especially with Disney. I feel like these would be great gifts. And then they have these smaller bins and they're individually priced. So you have $2, $10, you have brand new sets here. That's crazy. Pirates of the Caribbean. How cute is that, guys? I love this. I love antique things and I'm glad that I get to show you guys what they have. You have Sorcerer Mickey down there from Fantasia, which is really hard to find actually. And these watches are really hard to find too right now. And then coming on over to the next glass case, have more Disney pins and they all range. And they, you can buy the set or you can buy them individually. Crazy. I have a frame from 2008. A lot of sets. And then you have some miscellaneous items in this bin. And we have earrings here with birthstones, which is really pretty. And they're only $3, guys. $3. It's crazy. Let me show you all a pair so you can see what they look like. They have almost every month. And they were probably originally around 10 to $15. So we're gonna move on to another section. I'm gonna show you guys some furniture and things that they have here. But I love this, it's so cute here. They also have this glass case that's full of a lot of different memorabilia. But what stood out to me is Pinocchio right here, guys. Look how old that is. And they also have these Popeye crayons. There are $10 for the vintage crayons, and then um, Pinocchio is going to be $129, and he comes in the glass dome, but yeah, that's insane that they have this here. This is a great place to come if you're someone who's into these vintage items like I am. And I know this isn't Disney related, but they have a Jackie Robinson card for $24, his business card. How do you feel about that? It's a good deal. <laughs> and then it says you just ask for the key and someone can assist you if you're interested in any of these items. So we are walking up to another glass case and I see more Disney items. We have Tinkerbell, Timon, an Adventureland at the Gram, another Pinocchio, 101 Dalmatians. We have the genie and a Cinderella frame back there for $25. Oh, we have some vintage Mickey and Minnie plushes down here. It doesn't have a price on them, so they're probably a little more expensive. And I also see a Christmas like book or calendar all the way back there. I think it's it says fun and games. So I think it's a little game, but you have the seven dwarves down here. These are just all vintage toys. More Tinkerbell. It's really hard to find Tinkerbell items lately. So it's a great place if you need to Tinkerbell. And then we're walking into this section right here. There's a lot of glass items, but these definitely caught my eye. It's a ton of books, older books. So IDW issue 34, 32, and they're only three dollars and fifty cents. Show them off. <laughs> so 
so this is crazy. And I believe they also come with post stamps inside from what I'm seeing here. Uncle Scrooge, they have a, yeah, these are all like an Uncle Scrooge set. I spotted these, they were by themselves. I have a little Mickey Mouse on a bike, little toy. These literally look brand new. And then you have a Minnie Mouse. I think they repainted Minnie Mouse's eyes, but how cute are those? And they're just placed there by themselves. And if you look behind her, there's another little Minnie Mouse on the shelf there. And there's a lot of sports memorabilia here that I want to show you guys in case anyone is a fan of any of these teams. And what I thought was really cool were these Pepsi bottles, these long neck vintage Pepsi bottles. How crazy is that? Florida State University, you have the set there. This is a championship set for $35. And you have these. The Shack Attack pack from 1992 to 1993 for $25. You get the pack of six. So these are great to display in your home. And they also have the Saints, which my friend is a huge Saints fan, Coca-Cola bottle for $6. So you can buy them individually. Or if you're a Carolina Panthers fan, but yeah, how amazing is that? Okay guys, so I spotted some more Disney items. We have Mickey Mouse here, some mugs for $6.50. You have shot glasses or like Disney likes to say toothpick holders. And then you have some Funko Pops. You have a Barbie princess. Oh, and that's actually Tinkerbell in there. I have a little Star Wars toy up there. You have some Pez dispensers from the 90 Years of Magic. Mickey and Minnie set. And then if you come around this way, there's some more shot glasses. There's actually a set here in the box. So that's pretty cool. And I'm also seeing some more bags here. The stuffed Minnie Mouses. Those are really cool. And you have some Star Wars action figures here. These were actually at the Character Warehouse outlets. So I'm thinking maybe they bought them. And you have more Funko Pops over here. They're not Disney, but I just want to show them to you guys in case you have interest in them. That's all pretty cool. They're also selling, I believe these are handmade face masks. These are children's size. They range three to four dollars. And look guys, they have a Mickey Mouse one. How cute is that? And if you're headed to Universal, they have some Universal ones, so. And Looney Tunes right there. That's great. And there's also some Minnie Mouse messenger bags here on the side. We found this frame down here in this little like corner all by itself, another Disney item. You have Disney and Friends Volume 2 for $60. Um, it must have been during the 2000 period considering you have Fantasia right here. That's what I'm thinking. Um, but yeah, it's pretty cool. You have a lot of characters on there. I love seeing the old Cinderella and Sorcerer McGee. Brings back so many memories. Just found this little football Mickey figurine. How cute is that? Let's see if there's a price on him. Want to be really gentle. Yep, he is $8. How adorable. And there's also one back here. I believe this is tennis. Oh, how cute are those guys? If you have someone in your family that plays a sport, that would be a really nice gift. Okay, so this is the section that I was like most excited about because it's the larger items. I'm a cast member, so I normally shop these items at Cast Connection um, in a secondhand area, but here we are. Sorry if the music is a little loud, but they have a Disney Cruise Line prop chair used on the ship right here by itself. Great condition, especially considering it's white. And then you have Disney Saratoga Springs Leather Ottoman, 75 bucks. And then you also have a Christmas wreath here from the old Key West Resort. 
lots of ornaments still on it and it's running for 150 and there's also a second one behind it in case you want both you want a pair and then you have a planter prop here $65 very long very pretty and behind here I'm seeing a flower and garden display I believe this is from last year and it's running for $50. We also have this really pretty gold Christmas tree for $35. Doesn't say where it was used, just says that it was a prop. And you have a glass case here from Hollywood Studios, the launch bay. Hey guys. <laughs> for $85. It says that it was used there, so amazing. You can buy some displays if you're a big Disney fan, some Christmas decorations, and there's even a bellhop cart here. Let's see where it was from. Yeah, so Animal Kingdom Lodge luggage cart, and it was used by cast members, of course. This was luggage cart number K17. And then you have Disney's Animal Kingdom Lodge TV Hutch from their resort rooms. This says that it was sold, but it was going for $95. It was part of a sale going on and it comes with this LG TV inside, which is great. And you have another Animal Kingdom Christmas garland. This would be so pretty to decorate outside for $60. You also have this mirror right here, which I actually purchased one of these and I was a cast member. And it is going for $35. I paid around $10 for it at Cast Connection. And this is what they look like. And they're from the Wilderness Lodge. Then we have this really cool prop from the Wilderness Lodge. At least that's what the sign says. I'm not really sure. It kind of reminds me of Toontown. Anybody else remember Toontown? And you also have a red barrel here for $35. This actual prop though, I don't see a price on it. And then they do have an already built Christmas tree with pine cones, little cherries on it, and lights for 50 bucks. And it just says Disney prop, but it doesn't say the location. They're not sure where it's from. So that's pretty cool. So Justin pointed out this Disney hot air balloon. Um, I'm not sure the price or where it's from, but you can tell it's really old and it has Mickey and Donald all over it, but it's adorable and it just was in like the most random corner all by itself in this corner with all these other little antiques, but how cute is that guys? It's adorable. Let's come around this way so you can see it a little better. Oh wow. A lot of plush items and a lot of figurines over here. A lot of vintage figurines. I'm not going to walk over there because I have a big purse on and there's a lot of glass, but wow. They have just so many things that bring back so many memories. It's crazy. They have a frame over there from 2001, Animal Kingdom Tree of Life frames, Mickey Mouse, Disney Cruise Line, everything. Does anyone remember collecting these VHS tapes? Because I know I do. My mom still has pretty much all of them. And they have an Aladdin set. It's a lot of older things mixed with new items, but I love it. I think it's great. And these Vinylmations, these were very popular at one point. So it's crazy to see that. And they even have a Brother Bear plate. Brother Bear is definitely a throwback. And they have an, a mug warmer that comes with a Mickey Mouse mug. And down here they have some a vintage Snow White set. And like I said, just a lot of old mixed with new, but I'm really enjoying it. guys I didn't even realize it but look at this Mickey Mouse telephone in the corner right here how crazy I remember I used to have a phone like this in my room I used to play with landlines pretty much don't exist anymore but 
this would be a really cute decoration. And I just turned around and I found more VH sets. So if you still have a VHS player like I do, you can totally purchase some VHS tapes here. The more vinyl mission, but they're just the larger ones. A little Dumbo and Tigger bookends. This is more like the toy and kid section, I guess you could say. We have more landline cell phones here. I guess this is the one that was in the box maybe, but it's out of the box right over here. And it's going for $28. And then you have another phone over here. This one's in a lot better condition. It's also going for $28. So definitely look around while you're here because you never know what you might find. Also might see some pins in this bin right here and Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse nutcrackers. I actually already have a Mickey, but I'm really in need of a Minnie. So I might purchase her if she's a good price. And we have more pins here, guys. You never know. You never know what you might find. And guys, right here they have a lot of sets of cards. They're only $2.50. You can get a set of nine collectible cards. And they have a calendar here. Dreams come true, $12. Oh no, it's a lithograph portfolio set, actually. I have so much here, guys. Mickey Mouse. Walt Disney's Mickey Mouse magazine. What? Celebrating New Year's. Brian Bob. Oh my goodness, guys. This is insane. Two dollars. And then you have some framed photos over here of the princesses. Oh, here we go. Found the jackpot. A jungle book. Sketches. Sketches. And, oh, Pinocchio. Oh, and Mickey Mouse. Those are great. I love this. And Beanie Babies. <laughs> and they have a whole section with some vintage Disney clothes. Guys, you have this t shirt here for $8. And right now, Vintage Disney is super in. Everyone's been buying and reselling these items. And they have so many for adult and children. Look at this Tigger Windbreaker. Remember my sister used to have one of these. And you have a grumpy button down. And you have this famous shirt. Everyone's been wearing these for sure. And you even have Walt Disney Studios Entertainment Mickey Mouse sweater, extra large for only $8. So the clothes here is super inexpensive and you're getting items that everyone is wearing right now. I really like this red long sleeve. I think it's so cute. You have Donald and Mickey on it with the pocket seat. It's a size large for $8. And you have more things hung up here. You have a Disney Wide World of Sports. Dog's not spoiled, that's hilarious. 2019 shirt. And then you have some sports teams. So, a little bit of everything. Found another sweatshirt behind once I started moving everything around. A lifeguard on duty, how cute is that? It's $8, it just doesn't have a size on it. I'll be showing you guys today because there's just so much here, but they have these vintage hats, which are really, really cool and are also being resold online for so expensive and they have them here for so inexpensive. I just want to show them to you guys. How funny is that? I'm gonna make a mouse out of you. But yeah, that is pretty much it for the video today. I hope you guys enjoyed this, enjoyed seeing Disney items, um, coming with me to the Lakeland Antique Mall and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Don't you worry. Bad thing, we're gonna be